New York, Henry Silva, a prolific character actor best known for playing villains and tough guys in The Manchurian Candidate, Ocean's Eleven and other films, has died at age 95. Silva's son Scott Silva told Variety that his father died Wednesday of natural causes at the Motion Picture and Television Country House and Hospital in Woodland Hills. Silva was a New York City native who dropped out of school as a teenager, in the 1940s. He was accepted the following decade into the actor's studio, where fellow students included Shelley Winters and Ben Gazzara. He went on to have a long and busy career in film and television, with hundreds of credits before retiring from acting in 2001. He had a breakthrough role on stage and screen in the 1950s as a drug dealer in a hat full of rain and supporting parts in two of Frank Sinatra's best-known movies, both from the early 1960s, Ocean's Eleven, the Las Vegas heist film that was a showcase for Sinatra, D. Martin and other Rat Pack. In his last film appearance, Silva was cast in the Ocean's Eleven remake from 2000 that starred George Clooney and Brad Pitt. Silva was also seen on such television series as Wagon Train and the FBI, and in such films as Warren Beatty's Dick Tracy, Jerry Lewis' Cinderella and Ghost Dog, The Way of the Samurai, in which he played a mobster in the 1999 release directed by one of his admirers, Jim Jarmusch.